The Shano Country Miles of Art event is this weekend. There'll be lots to see, and Angela Kelly is getting a look at some of it this morning. Hi, Ange. Good morning. We're joining you from the Puvans Art Studio, just about three miles north of Shano. Now, if you take a look around, you can see some beautiful portraits hanging on the walls. This, these were done by Judy Puvans, and this is her private art studio. You can visit this place as part of the Miles of Art event going on in Shano and Menominee counties this weekend. And Judy, what are you working on now? Well, this is a great blue heron. It's a commission piece. And I basically laid out the background in charcoal to work out the composition. And now I'm just blocking in the heron in acrylics. It will be, the finished painting will be an oil. And there's a lot of detail work with the heron and the feathering mm -hmm. and the whole background area. Can you show us some of your technique, what you were doing here just a minute ago? Well, I was just putting in some of the darks here uh, just to get some of the shading in. But again, this is very rough at this point mm -hmm. because the finished portrait will be showing the, the uh, feathering, very detailed work. It's very, very beautiful. And so m much of your other work is beautiful. Do you want to share with us maybe a story of, of some of the pieces that you've done? Well, there's this piece here that was done a number of years ago about the sturgeon run in Shano that happens every spring. And the particular sturgeon that they're tagging right now, that they're gathering the eggs from, is one that's 120 years old. Uh, Ron Brook documented that. And this was a drawing for this painting. Uh, a lady won it at the time they had a, um, a drawing going for it. It's, it's absolutely beautiful. And I see um, a lot of Native American art in here as well. Right. This fellow was from the 1800s. His name was Tin Tin Mitza. Mm -hmm. um, I love working in charcoal because you can get such lines in their faces and, and the, the whole scenario. I, I used to do old people a lot because of the lines in their faces. Um, well, you, you do a very beautiful job. So again, you can come and visit the Puban's Art Studio. It's one of about nine different studios that are opening their doors to the public. Uh, it's a huge celebration of the arts uh, this weekend in Shano and Menominee counties. So we'll toss it back to you guys. Thanks, Ian.